Yeti Nation, Coach Marty, hope you're doing well. I miss you. I'm gonna show you a quick and easy fun out that we can do together. I'm gonna start with big arm swings. I'm here at my house, safe and sound, feeling good, but I gotta keep moving. I have got to keep moving. I'm gonna never stop moving. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel a little bit better about everything. Now I'm gonna take my arm swing backwards, make my movements big, reaching up as high as I can, take my scapula back and down. So I am moving my entire upper body. Feels good. Now, I'm just gonna take my arms straight up and throw them down. Up, throw them down. Up, and throw them down. I'm just shaking out at the bottom. I'm shaking my hands out. Any negative energy I may have, they're shaking them out. Shaking them out, maybe two more times. Shake, reach up high. Shake. Now, just my right arm, I'm going to swing forward. Again. And now, just my right arm, I'm going to swing back. Making them big. Big arm swing. Now, my left arm, forward. And my left arm swings back. Good. Now, a little right-left brain activity. Right arm swings forward. Left arm swings back. Nice. That's a little hard, a little challenging. Two more. Oh. Left, forward, right back. There it is. Three, two, one. From here, I'm gonna take it to just a right knee. I can take this knee to a running knee or a marching knee if I'm a runner, or I can break a board. Pow, break a board. I'm gonna do three more, two, two more, last one. Left side, same thing, I can run. I'm gonna do that for about five. I can keep that run or I can go break a board. Three more, that was 10 total. Last one, now I'm gonna do a right kick. Knee up, extend, and bring it back. Keeping my balance. Again, knee up, extend, take it back down. Right kick, five, four, three, two. Now look, I'm gonna add a left knee, ready? Left knee, right kick, left knee, right kick, left knee, right kick. You ready for five? Left knee, right kick, four, three, two, one more. Good, now left kick, knee up, extend, put it back down. Knee up, extend, take it back down. So it's a left kick for five. Three more. One more. Now, right knee, left kick. Ready? Five. Right knee. Four. Three. Two. Good. Heart rate's already up. Now, I'm gonna to move to the other side of the mat, all the way to one side, standing on the edge. I'm gonna step out to the edge of the mat into a squat, make sure my knees are straight, hips go back, head up, then I'm gonna to step together. Step out to the other edge of the mat, hips back, chest up, heart open, step together. So it's a side squat and back together. You ready? Let's go five. Five, four, hips back. Watch your knees. Three, make sure they stay over the ankles. Two, one more and hold. Knees are over the ankles. Should be able to see your toes. Hello, Patrick. Hello, SpongeBob. Those are my socks. I'm gonna step back together. Over to the other side of the mat. Step it up. Hips back, not knees forward. Head up, heart open, and then step together. Side squat, together. Side squat, hips back, together. Five, ready? Five, four, three, two, excuse me, one. Holding it there. Hips are back, knees point straight. Head stays up. Maybe a little dry land ski training. Holding my squat low. 
legs are burning. I'm going to step together to one edge, then back. Then to the other side, and back. Stay low. Stay low. Maybe three, two, hold. Three, two, one. Woo! Now, I'm going to move to the edge of my mat. Take my feet about shoulder width apart. Excuse me. <coughs> See? Coughing. A little dab. I'm going to lower down. My feet are shoulder width apart. Because I'm going to walk out into a push-up plank position. Keeping my head up. Hands are directly under my shoulders. Now, holding this push-up plank position, I'm going to make sure I keep my stomach muscles nice and tight. Keeping my back flat. No old ridden horse. No Mount Humphreys. Flat. Head up. And I'm going to hold. Now I'm going to walk down to my plank. My plank, thumbs up. Fingertips pointed forward. I'm not going to bring my hands in. I'm going to hold them out. Retract my shoulder blades. Throw my heart out in front of me. So I'm going to shift my body weight forward. Now I'm going to squeeze my stomach muscles. And I'm going to squeeze my gluteus muscles. And I'm going to hold. And I'm going to keep squeezing that. Keep breathing. Transverse abdominis. That's a deep core muscle. I am squeezing. Rectus abdominis. Gluteus maximus. All of that. Holding it. Hold it. That's my core. I'm strong in my center. I'm strong everywhere. Keep holding it. I'm there with you. Squeeze for five, four, three, two. Take a knee and rest. Now that's a proper plank. A Coach Marty proper plank. Back flat. Head up. Body weight shifted forward to keep that heart pushed out in front of you. And then we squeeze. We squeeze stomach. We squeeze the back side of the body, the front and back. That's why I love planks. It works the front and back of the body. Now we take it back again one more time. Hold that plank. I got my feet together behind me on this one. Fingertips again are pointing forward with my thumbs up. Retract my shoulder blades. Throw my chest out in front so my heart in front of me. And I squeeze. Squeeze all those core muscles that we talked about. Keep squeezing. Keep breathing. Keep squeezing. Keep breathing. Now nothing is sagging. My belly button is pulled up. So I'm holding my stomach muscles really super strong. Yeah, that's hard. Two-minute planks are incredibly hard to do if you do a Coach Marty proper plank. Keep squeezing. Maybe shift forward a little bit. Squeeze. Five, four, three, two. Now I'm going to walk up and down. I'm going to walk up and down. One more time. I'm going to walk up, lower down into a push-up and go. <laughs> That's just fun. I just feel good. Feel so much better. Maybe five push ups. Four, three, two, one. Because I can. Yeti Nation.